Hello, it's Andrew Hill from Sydney. I'm a tennis coach and sports coach and have been in the job for about 40 years. And in that time, I realized that um, we had a very good chance of finding our next star if we had a, a very good base to work with. So it's just a little intro. I now, I was the head coach of Sydney International Tennis Centre and had the privilege to work on the tennis camp with uh, Leighton Hewitt. Uh, in Sydney International Tennis Centre and ha have now become the Education Director of AATC which is the Austra Australasian Academy of Tennis Coaches. Now in that time I focused completely on tennis but by increasing the base I started to focus a little bit wider on multi-sport programs and one in particular that I'm going to talk to about today is the Sports Star program which focuses on all kids, all sports, really athletic movements and then a pathway into tennis. So the reason I started this is I had a image of it takes a village to raise a child. So we have to work together and create a very positive sort of environment. Uh, I have my own three kids and I was creating my own home in that sort of positive way. But at the same time, I started to realize when I wrote this material, I could share it with the communities. And it does impact 25 million people in Australia, of that 3 million kids. Just recently, the Healthy Kids program gave a D rating, which tells you that kids are probably sitting on phones and computers and not getting out and being physically active. So I started to realise that the TV or any screen is very powerful. And one of the problems was that a lot of kids were spending too much time. So I created a concept where I could talk to the kids through the screen and create uh, more of an education platform. Now the other idea was as a tennis coach I was focusing on about 5% of the community uh, who were playing tennis and I really wanted to focus on 99 so I started to focus a little bit more on the all sports and in that time created a few programs to actually help feed in to find our next tennis star and this was to improve the next generation with positiveness. So we created a brand called Stars and Stars is a little character mascot plus the five letters and the five letters stand for school talent area region state a pathway from real school to my case in Sydney Olympic Park and the talent ID program was to help kids learn but in helping them learn, we also found some future stars in our local areas, shops, parks, schools, and, and then next thing, our councils. And then we organized a free get together in the holidays for a whole lot of different councils to come together and play at Sydney Olympic Park. And Sydney Olympic Park was an amazing place in the year 2000. So we've continued that sporting idea and keep the legacy going. The theme of the star, stars like suns emit energy and warmth and brightness. So they actually stand out and offer a lot of positiveness, but they also stand out and attract people. So we get a lot of tourism, people like that, and we have our own mascots. Uh, the star shape is actually linked to our Southern Cross, and it's very powerful. It's sort of like our our own little theme is complementary of many different ideas, so hidden things. So the idea of STARS TV, it works on a computer, uh, can work in a school, on a smart screen, but was a game of chasing. So catch the STARS, be on STARS TV, and we were doing these activities out in public, and then the mascots would come out and start the games, but then kids would just play games, and we'd even bring out attract people from all different ages as you'll see. We have a system and there's a lot of shapes that you'll see in this system and you'll see the word shape what it's used for. So we've got the triangles, the stars, the circles and the squares and when you put them all together it's uh, it makes nearly like a rainbow and you'll see there's there's links with all the colors how it comes together and the reason for the shapes is we had our theme of shaping the world a smile at a time. So the shapes around the outside, 
the world are all the different colors, um, all the different countries. The smile uh, was coming down to being positive and then time you'll see how that sort of links in with what we're doing as well. So in our TV there are like menus on the top bottom and you've got the different countries, you have the different ages, you have the different times of the year and you have the different subjects. And when you touch different things it breaks down right into as you'll see we go into, um, oh, we meet some of the specialists who have their own specialty. You know, in my case, I'm a PE lecturer and sports and tennis coach. So I was sports star and sharing ideas, but we have a whole lot of people, singing star, dancing star, and they're all part of things that a child will learn in their journey through primary school. So we find other people who have got passion to share information, and that's what the TV does, different channels, different themes. An example, Sports Star. So Sports Star, there are 15 sports within the TV in 12 different languages. Kids learn the skills and play the game. And it's, it's very simple, but it can also go right through from beginner right through to elite. The cards are very simple. So there's five points, with, which are the five fingers. And just showing kids how to do something and this helps teachers and parents help children learn skills. Then we've got some cartoons and just making it a little bit fun for the kids so they could look at uh, the content as well and just reinforce what we're doing. So it's really to help kids learn skills so they become more active. We then organize events and sometimes the events could be in the holidays, other times special events throughout the year. So one big thing we do is the Christmas carols and the stars are up on stage and we're doing a bit of singing. But at the event we're playing some sporting things uh, whilst there's a Christmas theme. We do Australia Day which is in a few different areas and Sydney Olympic Park is one of our biggest. Uh, we can go and do special events on being healthy in, in Parramatta. Uh, we go into the city and join other areas which was the Santa Fund Run. So there's a whole host of events throughout the year and we join in with the star theme. Uh, kids catch the stars and then they see themselves on the stars TV. One of our favourite things from these events, we create a little bit of tourism. And we've created a, a game called the biggest game of hide and seek around Sydney. And we talk to people through Instagram and our whole website is powered by Google. And we're excited to share that we just hit 25 million hits on Google Maps. And they're all the different locations. So the star characters can actually be everywhere at once. They can be augmented, but they can be real as well. So part of this journey is to get the brand out and then welcome people from the community uh, to get healthy, active and creative. There's a few resources that you could use. So you can either send me an email. We've got some great websites there. Uh, a lot of these things are free to try and activate other communities through our system. And then there's also tennis specific ones to actually help you all the way through. So my um, website has a few different videos you can get to know myself and what we do in our tennis center but a lot of it has been created through this active and creative kids and then we introduce the kids to the star gives them a high five to start with but then we just go about our business uh, when we do the award session sports star comes out uh, we can actually go to schools and sports star tells all the kids in the school about being healthy and active so it actually works quite well uh, it's very colorful uh, we get a lot of material on radio where we can just talk about some of the new things happening and we actually link with Sydney Olympic Park and a lot of the councils. There's a whole lot of video that we've done and some of it is content of when we've done things on TV, uh, kids shows and then our own content. So we're just really introducing people into having fun and playing games. and. Here are just a, an example of some of the things. So on a tennis court, we're playing golf, putting and chipping. We're playing hockey. We actually play court cricket. We can, this is indoors, but we can actually play badminton outside. 
Uh, we're doing football. Uh, there's a whole lot of games that we can play. And going back to our multi-sport theme, it's called court sport. And we always come back to our tennis game. So every kid's having a go of every sport. But uh, the idea was to increase that base so more people play tennis. And we've got some great videos there. So 20 years since the 2000 Olympics, we've been doing this program all the way through. And the stars have been there along for the ride. And uh, we'd love to see you in Sydney Olympic Park. We play under the cauldron and we do a whole lot of things with the Olympics and the Paralympics and the Commonwealth Games. So we link in uh, every two to four years and we celebrate and get active and be positive out in the open. So thank you for your time and look forward to hearing from you.